Away from the news, Ten's seemingly endless Australian Idol promotions are really annoying viewers. Brick bats to the idiot in the control room at Channel 10, who superimposed an ad over the credits at the end of the movie Cracker Jack on Friday night. We checked, and lo and behold, as the credits rolled on Mick Malloy's film Cracker Jack, as viewers hung on to hear what had happened to the central characters in the film, this. There are a couple of matters I'd like to address before we put this story to bed. Australian Idol is just two days away. We've got the best talent. Our judges are ready. Zico's back. Idol set to go off. And that's just the beginning. There's no better place to be. Seriously. It's a seriously annoying practice which stops you seeing the credits. And it's even worse when it obscures part of the story. Mercifully, the ad ended in time for viewers to catch a little info on what happened to Cliff, Edgar, Ron and Norm. Oh yeah, here's trouble. Cliff, Ron, Edgar and Norm went on an end of season bowling trip to Corowa. I'd love to tell you more, but well, you know the rules. What happens on tour stays on tour. And as for the rest of the characters, seriously, you don't need to know. Mick Malloy tells us... Well, I think the most disturbing thing about that particular sequence was it was Kyle Sanderlands whose face appeared to disturb the, the end credits. That'll be shocking to most people. I'm sure when, you know, they reveal the horse's head in Godfather next time, <laughs> there'll probably be a little pop-up. Tells you, uh, you know, Dr Harry Cooper's coming up after the break. Who knows? Um... I think we should. I think it's just. It's just. A, it's a little rude. We should maybe acknowledge everyone uh, for their fine work and everyone who contributes and everyone who's given their labour to something they love. It's their moment to be recognised. G'day everyone. Just thought I'd pop in to ruin the credits of Media Watch. <laughs> Monica Attard presenter. We all know that. The rest, who cares? Let's squash them into a little box just below me, just like that. We don't care. You know why? They're minions. <laughs> Sure, they've given their labour to something they love, but at the end, who cares? 